What's up guys? Evil Fun is here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to optimize Windows 11 for the best performance on the Acer Predator Helios 300. So, let's get started. First, open your browser and type in the URL bar https colon slash slash github.com slash builtbbel slash bloatingoc slash releases. Once you're on the page, you'll see four options to download. Click on Bloaty Nosy Setup, MSI, to download the Bloaty Nosy application. Once the file is downloaded, go ahead and install the Bloaty Nosy app on your Acer Predator Helios 300. Now, open the app, and you'll notice that several options are checked by default. However, you can customize this according to your preference. Feel free to check or uncheck the settings and apps that you want to analyze for potential performance issues. Once you're done selecting the options, click on the Analyze button. The app will now analyze all the identified bloatware and settings that might cause performance issues on your Windows 11 system. After the analysis is complete, you'll notice that certain text is underlined in blue. Click on this underlined text, and it will allow you to individually check or uncheck the settings or apps according to your preferences. Take your time to review and adjust these settings based on your needs. Once you're satisfied with your selections, click on the Fix button. The app will provide you with two options, Apply Fixes and Restore Default State. To apply the changes you've made, click on Apply Fixes. But if you ever want to revert back to the default settings, you can click on Restore Default State. Great! You've applied the fixes to optimize your Windows 11 system. Lastly, make sure to restart your Acer Predator Helios 300 to allow the changes to take effect. And that's it for this video, guys! I hope this tutorial helped you optimize Windows 11 for the best performance on your Acer Predator Helios 300. If you found this video useful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more tech tips and tricks. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.